first solar farm video in a couple of years. This is just a um, experiment with trying to cut down on the noise um, conducted along the output um, supply by this uh, Sunforce Pro Series um, PureSign Inverter. Rather noisy. Um, currently what seems to work is a combination of this isolation transformer which basically acts as a big LC choke filter because there's about a few microfarads of um, capacitance across the uh, output receptacle so it acts kind of as a big uh, LC filter to help cut down on some of the noise and then what's left is taken care of by a um, filter in this power distribution block thing that I got quite a number of years ago basically using it as a QRM suppressed power strip with a couple of uh, LED nightlights just to show that something's plugged in and there's just a bit of a test this healer crap sounds more or less normal which is good no noise being uh, from the capacitor screaming bloody murder due to all the uh, QRM being fed in on the lines. And this shop light sounds more or less normal. Proper magnetically ballasted early 1940s but post 1941 uh, Crawford that's featured in some other videos. And this chili crap sounds normal. And this yellow crap, which is a 13 watt feet electric um, bug lamp, has this weird visual artifact where viewed through the uh, optics of this light, it's just a converted uh, Lights of America crappy Florex bucket light where it just ripped out the ballast from the rectifier of the lamp holder. I have a couple of fixtures that have been so modified. Um, this image of the lamp seems to flicker a lot. But these two outer images of the lamp look more normal, although they flicker a bit on camera, but that could be just some, some kind of a beat frequency artifact between the camera frame rate and the, uh, I know, some flickering artifacts of the uh, discharge, because viewed directly, the discharge appears more or less normal. And this radio sounds more or less normal. Great it is the greatest radio in the world. Which is why it's one of our shop radios. And as is to be expected, this geolos lamp is performing normally on inverter electricity.